All right, uh, YouTubes, got South Park playing in the back. Just wanted to actually post a video for the first time in a while, I suppose. Did, uh, did my Primaris captain here. Hmm. I eventually want to paint more as uh, time goes on on the little back there. I want to. I'm not really good at the freehand, but I want to do a dragon definitely. All right. And then maybe paint some wording somewhere. I'm not really, really good at that yet, but we'll see. This is basic for now. Uh, good. Leaves room for creativity, getting the, the necessities down for the paint job at least. Try to make it look at least a little decent. Ready? Yeah. And then I touched up uh, my apothecary because I don't know. It's just like in seventh edition, I really, 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 really enjoyed the fact that uh, with the Iron Hands chapter tactics, you can you'd be able to recover wounds, right? With the iron, <laughs> that was dope. But uh, you know, eighth editions come along, made the game better, I think, overall. But you know, like I'd still have appreciated uh, more of a, a, a role playing customization uh, aspect to it. More so than what we got. I also touched up my uh, the windows on the pit and cockpit here, so it's not just like a flat orange. And attempted to do something similar here. Uh, yeah, I'm not really the best painter, but just want to at least make them match a little bit, you know. So that way you can clearly say, "Hey, this is my army." Obviously, I'm going to put more time into the characters that that I want to, like my Primaris Captain here. I took off the uh, the shoulder the shoulder pad that normally comes with it and put a dragon head instead. I like that. I don't know. I just I wanted I wanted to be able to customize it and say it's my own, you know, and then uh, you know, that's why I put a little fire on there too for like the burning blade aspect because I'm always, I'm always going to give that relic to that guy. Mmm, so good. And then along with Iron Resolve, you plus one wound and six thing, but like, anyways, and then this is, this is a Terminator Captain I'm painting. I'm not really good at flesh t color yet, so I'm sort of stepping away from that. I want to finish the black at least, you know, accent gray on there, and then finish basing the model. Uh, yeah. No, I'm not. I'm not again. Like I can, I can stay on the lines or whatnot, but definitely not too, uh, too driven to make this super focused by any means. But yeah, just going back to. No, that's too much. And too much. Ooh, that's nice. Thank you, natural lighting. Just when you need it. But as you can tell, like I fucked up on the paint job there. You know, because it got like texture. I wish it was a little more flat tone, but definitely got texture. Maybe that's just, yeah, a poor spray paint job. Definitely, definitely need to uh, maybe redo this as a whole at some point. I don't know. I just had such unfortunate luck with spray painting this. I went, uh, I, w I did it outside to respect my dad, and then, uh, and yeah, just I don't know, cool gust of wind made it so thick so so thick so quick i don't know uh maybe i'm i'm not spray painting properly like technique wise in general but like i i i thought i did the recommended you know stay like maybe maybe 10 15 centimeters away from the uh, from the model you know do quick quick things so i could get the color down which i did and generally if it's not all black like i don't really care too much just so long as the main parts are black and that I need for the undertone and then go lighter from there but uh, yeah and then even with the uh, protective coating I tried to put on after that it just uh, that uh, you know frosted it a little bit so I had to paint over it Let's... yeah I don't know if you see the little spots there but yeah, yeah. Definitely frosted. I know some of the, your your veteran painters, you'll you'll notice that, you'll notice it for sure. But anyways, you know, it's, it, I tried. All right. Well, thank you for taking the time to go through this. Uh, yeah.